what's up everybody? It's your boy C Sleazy and I'm back with another with another little video for you boys. So I've been I've been in the lab, right? And because there's not really a lot of good animations out there for everybody. So I've been in the lab a little bit and this is what I've got as the best animations in the game for crossovers and stuff. Just pause the video, take a screenshot, do whatever you need to do, right? This is what I'm working with right now. These sets of dribble moves, right? And I was working and I couldn't figure out, you know, how to do any of my combos from last year. Momentum cross behind the back, any of that, right? So if my game will load. Ah, oh, 2K bugs. Okay. This is what I've learned. Okay, so the momentum cross is still in the game. Like, it's still in the game, right? But it's a little bit different the way you do it. You just hold. Alright, see, if you did it like I used to do it, it, it like, it's kind of confusing, but it's just something you gotta get a uh, feel for. And that's, this right here is about to be the new meta. Like, it, it's so clean, as I missed the shot. Oh, I made it. But look, <laughs> like, that's honestly the best way to dribble. Like, you can, you can still do your momentum cross behind the back and everything, but it's a lot more realistic, and I know... I can guarantee you that this year, if you do the momentum cross like last year, your stamina is gonna just drain. Like, I can guarantee you that. And a tip, if you're playing the My Career Story, if you like playing it, when they ask you if you wanna do the movie, say no. And if you say no and you do the training, you get plus four stamina, right? And that's the, that's the momentum spin right there. I don't know if there's a different spin I need to have on or what, but that is the momentum spin. And it's, the spin is the same as last year, just the way it registers, isn't it? So, like, if you it, it, if you knew how to dribble last year, it's not going to be too hard to adjust, but there is there is going to be some stuff that you just have to change. A lot of dribbling this year, like dribbling like this, you don't use the right stick. Now, not the right stick, I mean, RT, you always use the right stick. Now, for, go back to the your screenshot or whatever, you'll see the hop jumper. The hop jumper is 21, or just set it as 21, right? That's this hop jumper right here. This quick one. That's, what I've seen so far, that's the best hop jumper in the game. I don't, like, for for a dribbling build, there's nothing really better than, than having that um, hop jumper. But, like, the dribbling is gonna be like 2K17 in a way with the standstill, how a lot of people did standstill dribbling. Like, you're probably gonna see a lot of glitchy dribbles. Hold on, there's a little, like, in the ball moving really fast when somebody's dribbling. But I think if, unless a lot of stuff changes, not a, not even a lot of stuff, unless like more people get in the lab, like you got your Stizo, Stizos, G Man, people like that, once they start getting into the lab, then a lot of stuff will come out, right? A lot of like the attributes will come out, and I have my player right here has a 91 ball handling, right? And I was like, what's going on? Because at first when I was just trying to do my speed boost like last year, it was just doing that crossover like that. But remember, you have to hold RT or your right trigger, whatever that is. And once you do that, you're fine. Now I'm still working on like my hesitation and stuff and all that, but so far. I mean, this it's pretty it's pretty good. I don't have any dribbling or playmaking badges, so what I've seen, you don't need any playmaking badges just to do the simple dribble moves. Like you can still combo up and you find something that you like. You know what I'm saying? Like if you don't like the way Curry's uh, dribble moves are, use Kyrie's, use AI, use a pro, use somebody like that, and hopefully you can find something that you can work with because this year is. A, a lot of like different stuff on maybe everybody will have the same stuff on after they like copy youtubers but to be at the beginning of the year it's gonna be really interesting how people fluctuate throughout drill rooms and stuff and do their own thing but it's, it's a lot different from last year for sure it's a lot different but it's something you can get used to pretty easily if you just put in like I've been in the, my my court for about 15 minutes and I've learned how to do probably one of the my favorite moves this year so far and you got the, there's just a lot of different dribble moves this year. You see me doing like the little sham god and then the cross and uh, step back. Like, this is something you can just repeat. 
you can do a momentum cross step back like trust me that hop jumper 21 is a necessity you want to have that on because it, it changes the way your player moves now I don't know if it's like the part last year where your player would just lose the ball for no reason hopefully not because that's our only like real step back this year is the hop jumper but if you like if you guys like the video make sure you like share subscribe you know let everybody know where you got the dream rooms from your boy C Sleazy and I hope you enjoyed the video and I'm out peace